What is up everybody? Welcome to Geek Report. I am Tendai Balako and I'm very happy to see you guys again. Today we have an amazing show lined up for you. I'm going to teach you how to make your very own stylus, your very own S Pen and it can work on pretty much any phone out there with a touch screen interface. Okay, so this is what you need. It's optional but you might or might not need the pen, I'll explain why, but a pen and foil. So when I'm talking about foil, I'm talking about yes, the foil used for cooking, but if you do not have foil, you can also use uh, the chips that have the reflective back when you open them. You can take those packet of chips, rip that paper up, and use that as what I'm gonna explain to you briefly just now. And a rubber band, that's all you basically need, something to fasten. So all you're gonna need to do is gonna take your pen, you know, just a normal ordinary pen, uh, make sure it's not very sharp and can harm your phone, you know, like those fountain pens, no, you can use the fountain pen, just a normal ballpen pen. You take your ballpen pen and take your foil and carefully wrap two layers around the pen, especially with pointy. So you wrap two layers around it and you secure it with a rubber band. There are two options to go about this. If you're using the chips packet, you can actually roll the, the foil that comes inside the packet of chips into a cone shape like. And you can use that as your actual pen. Okay, fine, let's go over to our original project the pen that is wrapped with foil. Once you have that and it's fastened with the rubber bands, all you have to do is just simply, you know, go on your phone and just go ham, quite literally, that's all you have to do. Just use your phone, scribble up and about, and you can use it perfect for drawing. So I'm sure you guys have big tablets and you've not been able to actually draw something. You might be a Leonardo da Vinci in the waiting. Just simply go and just sketch. You can go and sketch with it. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Or you can just roll up into smaller paper and use it straight up and just draw on. That's a very useful application and it's a very useful thing whenever you want to do things that, are, that require pinpoint precision. So you can just go with that and you're all good. 